on top of each other. They just need to That's not big. make a mistake. And well, what's better than a mistake? Getting a knock onto Crook. But can they finish him off? Yeah, say that's the or best spot though. Teams make mistake and then you Casey, Casey if he just needs to play for second, bro, just kill this team. Teams are staggered directly on top of each other. Can't get too greedy for the kills over here. You can see the res potentially coming in for AP, but it's not quite yet because KCP is filtering on over Yeah, hey, let's go KCP. Needs to play big there we go. There you go. We're going to die here, but it's fine. As the backup as well. AP gets Unless Evan just shits on them. And now it's all up to ESA. Burhol says no. The oh my god. He gets knocked next, and that's Armor the swap. last thing you want to do is go toe to toe with Burholz. Armor swap one B one. Evan is nasty, bro. <laughs> Evan is <laughs> nasty. The win for KCP here in the end. What an amazing finish! Oh my goodness. He Burhol just shit the on them, bro. The kill leader for a reason popped off. I think he had 11 kills in that game. That's Evan just shit on them. TSM Burholz playing for KCP. What a win right there. We had three of our top four teams in that final circle, and you really couldn't ask for a better ending. That has to sink for ESA just a little bit. <clears throat> Absolutely fantastic play, though. Carl makes it four months. ESA had the openings, but Verhals has been on fire these last few games, and honestly, being able to survive that, get that armor swap, it was just unfortunate how they approached that last fight for ESA, kind of splitting up, setting up for that crossfire, and Evan was able to take advantage of that. What a fantastic... I hope he calls me. I'm going to see if he calls me. Let's go on over to Fallout and Sella to break down our final game of Storm. <coughs> He's got like a 20 bomb. He 1v3 them. He literally 1v3 them. Finesse, thanks for 10 months. And he dominates that one day, of course. Got some close shots. He was down about 30 or 40. He 1v1 one of them. The other guy came up and also died. The third guy just died trying to armor swap. And control the 1v1 cadence to win that one as well. And in the end, the kill leader. He actually just spin on them. What is like Fury just like trolled? And Verhol still wins this 1v1. What is fear, bro? <laughs> oh my god. Still with a 75 HP disadvantage. And then immediately gets the shield swap and takes out Amigo. And Amigo just basically gets caught. Gets caught. You know that the other team. Bro, they got to be up so, so much after that. They, there was like a 21 kill game. See how Verhol has been. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Of the last performance from the Kansas City Pioneers. Oh lordy. First place by a margin. KCP They're up by what? 100 or 16 points? Oh, he's calling me right now. He's calling me right now. Oh, no, oh, no. We saw some contention oh, over in Yo! Yo! Yo, you like that? You like that? I do like that! <laughs> what the f was that? I don't know, dude. I locked in. You just, what, you just locked in, huh? Bro, I'm on small dead zone still. I know. I was. I was just asking Chad if you're on. Uh, you're on small dead zone. It's farming, isn't it? Farming, yeah. 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 You do you think it's yeah, better than no dead zone? Really, I don't know. It might be. It, it's so. It's so much easier to snap on somebody when like your hit fight, like when you're ready to open a consistent place, you know? Yeah, bro. Literally, when I said like. like that's right. Since it's always moving around, you can't like consistently like snap on somebody. I don't know. Yeah. I I, I literally said right before. Up on cat right now. What's up? I'm right now. Oh yeah, wait, did you actually find his sleep from now? Or finally? You, compared to yesterday? Yeah, I got I actually slept. Nice. I was gonna say, I said right before you like 1v3 them at the end, I was like, the only way they win this is if Evan just shits on them. And then you just 1v3. Yeah. <coughs> is it, what, two more games of Rolls Edge, right? Yeah. Do you know the scoreboard? You guys up like by 16. I don't know, I mean, too. You're up by 16 points right now. What do the next three look like? Um, it's like you're at, a, you're at 111, um, Complexity's at like 95, and then it's ESA, I think. Yeah. Yeah. yeah I, don't, I, don't know if I don't know if we're gonna start it. I'll probably gonna ask you about it. You should, probably shouldn't. I don't, I don't think you should. Start? Well, I don't know if you guys watched the VOD, but you should definitely change your up. For sure. What's up? Okay, you're lagging. I, I'm, I'll, call, I'll talk to you later. No, they have, they have nine points, actually.
they're gonna have to really spread out here and have a huge presence and the thing is the game has been so slow for them that they haven't even used up all their utility you can see you got a the uh, beams uh, along with that uh arc star for verhul so stop so i did um singularity gotta get that kill pistillo goes down nasky picks up an extra kill for his squad lg scrambling up against esa right now lg this is a free game it's, it's gonna be literally just like a 3v3 at the end and that's it one more so both of these squads esa not gonna be long for this world as verholz finds one more on to fury on the they have six kills it's, this is ggs they have a high ground like if they throw this they're stuck versus Team Vizio, the way this all started, that's how it's gonna end. And it's gonna be KCP looking for another Rice thanks to 26 months. Right now. Nasky spots him below him, has the PK out for the 93. Nice. Oh, this is this is GG. Got like 20 points right there. It's basically over. They could probably die off spawn and they'll be fine. Like I don't think anyone's even close to them. They'll be up like at least 30 points. Level name coming in from Nigiri. So now we're down to these final moments here. Six spots still remaining. Verholz with the R301. He's definitely been the MVP of the day. Kill leader. Shit on him, Edwin. Shit on him. Pop off moments. A 2v1 to win the game on Stormpoint. Now the aggression starting to come in from KCP. Dell has taken some damage, but they do buy space. That's going to be complexity on the other side of this fight. Trying to hold the line. And if KCP can knock them down, I might actually leave things open for the rest of the lobby to try and secure the right, five months. position. But for the time being, it's going to be LG finding the knocks onto ESA. They knock him out. We're down to our final five squads. We've got LG, KCP, Complexity as well. And now Foot getting full sense on by KCP. Now, ah! Once more, going for the double peak. That's two knocks, only one more remaining. Taylor Easy wipe. Wait a bit. Bringing us down to our final four. <coughs> Nasky looking for that armor swap. You can see Nigiri still saying. Complexity died. It's from LG. They yeah, take it's down over. ESA. They it's take down over. Complexity, and they're trying to push the. Are they about to win this game too? That top four. It's about to be. It's, it's a three v three v one right now. Three v three v one. See Mystic trying to stay alive on overtones. <coughs> the side five kills, six a six for five kills, six assists. Excuse me for Jaguars. This is the final moment in the final game that we've been looking for. And they've got the P 3v3, Jack. Last red. That's 3v3. Out in third place. The kill leader now. It's going to be Jaguars <laughs> in the final 3v3. Dell takes to the skies with that gravity lift. Trying to focus one down. But he gets focused himself. Cracked as Nasky tries to chase. Oh, shit, Nasky. He does get the knock onto him. Bringing it down to a 3v2 for the health. No, Evan. There for KCP. Somehow oh, back no. The way. There's the clip out from Jaguars. Oh, shit, Evan with the book clip. The no, he lost. Then he, they didn't get the dub, but LG that secures the bag here in the final game. LG <coughs> to win in game number ten. He him, and it's just something that's honestly just a preview and a, and a prelude. I think it's maybe some foreshadowing for what we're gonna see here, Stella. Going.